How's it going, everybody? You made it just in time for another episode of Plucky Squire. Last episode, we did some rocket propelling around the 3D world, trying to find parts of a rocket's father, I guess, and did a little shoot 'em up mini game. But now we got the new ability to stop pieces of the book, so now we're good to venture on to hopefully Thrash's village. And doesn't look like we're there yet. Whoa, this path, it doesn't normally have a giant metal disc stuck in it. What happened, bunny dude? Huge saw blade, mate, came flying down, nearly cleaved me in twain. My life, it flashed before my very eyes. Oh man, scary stuff, are you okay? I'm alright, mate. It's quite a useful flashback, actually. I could see where I'd lost my keys. Well, that's something. Dot, we, can we can't carry on up this path. Let's find another way around. Keep rocking, bunny dude. Okay, we'll go the only path that's accessible to us. Can we fall off? No, okay. I have to check what we can interact with. There's Mini D Beard. These blocks look incredibly heavy. Let me go and tilt those big blocks, you will. Okay. Let's do a quick check. Uh, we want to move them all except this one. Okay. Come on, tilt book. There we go. Is that everything? Yeah. Okay. Just looking at it just in case there's something else I can do. Okay. Any secrets? Collectibles or anything? We'll probably see Martina soon for an upgrade. Adventurers, you have climbed high. You are strong, but danger ahead. The Mega Eagle. Usually Mega Eagle, not big trouble. The machines invading our territory make the Mega Eagle mad. Screech. Whoa, this is one big bird. Okay, well. Not gonna stop us now to look for secrets. There we go. And that's it. Use the Thunder Badge. May ascend. Try to avoid getting pecked to death by Mega Eagle. Yeah. We'll do our best. Thank you, bunny dude. Oh, more climbing. Once again, our heroes scaled the perilous rock face and steeled themselves for a wild encounter. Screech! The Mega Eagle! Oh, he's got shades! Rather annoyed, descending upon our heroes with a combative cry. Thrash twirled his drumsticks and got ready to rumble! To the beat! Oh, yeah. It's a pretty cool looking bird. Did I have to wiggle it? Well, half health? Okay. Probably gonna have another phase after this. Oh, 
I'm just kind of mashing with the snakes on me if I have to go left, right to shake it off. I like how it's zooming in. There we go. A new achievement. Doesn't look like it's over though. Oh no, he's leaving. Soared into the starry sky. That's it. Best smile upon its peak. Crash boy, you did good. You earned the respect of the big eagle. I mean, it didn't peck you to death. You're practically chums. We're nearly at the village now. The moment of truth approaches. Frog speed to you both. I want to get out there and chop all those bushes in case of cash. No, don't go through. Meanwhile, across the land, at Moonbeard's house. Now then, where were we? Where are we? Magic barrier spell, check. The spell of rebinding, all bound up. Ran, we're making good progress, Violet, my girl. Getting through it, yup, yup. Anyway, get back to what we were talking about. So we're characters in a book, but the people outside like Sam. They're really real? Yeah, we are back to this, are we? Well, it rather depends on what you mean by real. I feel real enough, don't you? Yes. Most definitely. Well, there we are then. We're real in our own way, all the people outside our, our, our world are real in their way. All really real. You think people out there can see us? Yep, and I think I can just about make them out too. Oh, there. <laughs> I know, I can sense that you're out there supporting us in some way. Thank you for your efforts so far. Let's all put our best foot forward, shall we? Which means, in this reality, we could have some wicked potions. Totally on the case. Back at Trog Mountain, our heroes continued their ascent. Hello, okay. What we have before us here, Jabba Dude, is a wall of ironweed. The toughest and gnarliest plant you'll ever encounter. So you kept that by bay on the righteous gardener of Trogs. But the gardeners are Mim Mia, so I'll... So the ironweed is Bib. Bib? That's back in business, dude. Okay. Thank you for the translation. Hello, hikers. Ironweed, eh? Tough shrub. I think I can help you out. I cooked up a mean weed killer. I need a special ingredient. A crush room. It's like a purple mushroom. Luckily, they often grow near ironweed. Get one... If you get me one, I might be able to rustle up something. Moonbeard out. Okay, we'll do that after we take care of collecting. Doesn't look like there's anything around here. Oh, I see the mushroom. Oh, good one. You got a crush room. And an overlad. Oh, we're 100 miles apart. Bit of a wrinkle in the plan, that. Well, maybe there's a way you could shortcut all those miles to get me that shroom. Okay. Good thing they had a page just now. Probably the one we need to use. There. Anything else on this page I need to do? Nope. Okay. Got it. Whoa. Good work, my boy. Bending space and time like a champ. Now hand me that crush room and I'll get cooking. Turn into a powder. Oh, no. Ta-da! We kill her bomb. You throw it at the iron weed, you'll dissolve it in a jiffy. Give it a go. Oh, and if you want any more bombs, I'll leave a few on the ground floor of my house. 
Happy garden then. Good luck, Jot. And away I go! Turn the pages again. There was one at the very start, though. Can we go back? Like, all the way back? I wish we could do this faster. Oh! Nope, 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 that was it. Oh, we can't... Uh... Are you able to go back here from a page? There we go. Might as well open this path first. Could be to a collectible. Could be a glitch bird even. Here we go. I'm assuming this I activate. Yeah, it's a glitch bird. Got him. On the third lost glitch bird. We're really good at finding glitch birds. Okay. I did find more, but I can't pick them up yet. They're kind of behind stuff that I can't interact with. Now I have to flip all the way back. He said at the base of his house. Anything else I can do here? Oh! Oh, okay. I see how it works. I walk all the way back. I think it's actually like two pages. Two pages the other way. There we go. Whoa, dude, that looks potent. I guess we just... How did I... Did anybody, like, jump... Oh, throw. There we go. Who wouldn't let me throw before? Gnarly, Boombeer's potions always do the job. Hey, get in. Oh, another big area. Are we actually fighting him, or is he just gonna talk? How's oh, he reporting for duty? Intruders, no pass. Dot, this is the village defense system, and it's that's Gazi, head of security. Yo, Gazi, my rocky fellow, we're on the way too. Intruders, no pass. Gazi know his job. Our description very clear. Stop intruder. But we're not. Intruder, no pass. Gazi, head of security. Gazi have responsibilities. Doesn't look like Gazi's going to be a to budge, but we have to get past them to the village. There's maybe some way to fold up old Gazi for a bit. Okay, let's see what we have to work with. Noisy pillar was an of ancient construction. I'm gonna need another blast room, it looks like. Oh, you're getting close to the mountain peak. More iron weed in your way, eh? Ground floor, my house, more bombs. Zonk, problem solved. Moon beard out. Might as well take out every enemy. Probably a door along the way that requires everything dead. Or not. Okay, back to Moonbeards. It takes a long time to do this. Hopefully there's not much more of this wood. Especially with how slow the pages turn. I think that's the main problem.
Der Innige auch. Mit a whole cave? Oh, it is. Okay. Hello there. How'd I get down here so quickly? Great secret. That is don't to think about it too much. Now that pillar, it's big, but it's fractured, so not very stable. But you could tilt it over. What do we got? Anything? Got a rockin' dinosaur. Can I walk to the other side? No. Oh, I have to be on the other side to oh, tilt it other way. There we go. But... Go back a page. See if I can interact with the left side. Oh, no, I can't. I see it. Okay. Let's go out, kill the enemies, then the door will open up. Saved a bit of time there before I hopped out. Got across the fractured pillar. Ah, follow the footprints to treasure. What do we got? Ooh, I missed one. Crap. Some early concept of game dev environments. This would eventually become Moonbeard's lab. Okay. That looks like a wizard's kind of place. I'll take the fracture with me. In case I can use it coming up. Yeah, I guess the throw doesn't do as much damage. Ooh, three hits! There. So I missed one secret somewhere. Gotta go back and find that eventually. Or it could be in Martina again. Oh wait, no, put that back. The noisy pillar. Oh, could it fracture because it's no fractured now? No. I think we have to rotate and knock him over. This should just kill him. Kill him or just stun him. Oh, wait, wrong way. Or not. Oh, we have to stop him? There. Putting all the powers to use. Irk! Security threat. How's he feeling woozy? One more hit. Might pull Gazi up. Okay, stop, run up, stamp him again. There we go. Okay. Uh, before I move on, though, let's head back and see if we can find the missing page. The page that is missing has a collectible for me.
Basically, I'm just looking for any page that has like a shimmer around it. If I had to guess, it's under that block. So far, nothing. Uh, time to go see Martina. This might be too far back. Is there anything I can do on this page? Like, go back? No. It could be not even here. It could be out in the world here. But I feel like I checked everything. Gotta be in the book. The problem is I gotta flip all the way back. There was the cave, and I've done the cave. I found one in there, so it's gotta be further than that. I'm gonna check with Martina. I have enough cash, I can buy a few things off her now too. No, no, not yet. Oh, let's see. Sword damage. I can buy both of these. Hold and release L2. Spin attack upgrade. You barely have to charge it. You can just press it once and it... Yeah, you, you don't... Can you do anything on the charge? No. Like, that's charge, this is tapping it. It's the same thing. Not even worth grabbing, I'd say. I thought I was going to find a collectible on her. Nothing on that page. Could be in a tree that I never- oh, wait a minute. No secrets up here to check. Okay. Checked everything on that one. Nothing worth checking on that one. Okay, my only guess is... Maybe... Nothing, okay. Don't need to close the book. Checked all those. I could check behind the gate. My one guess for a place. Could it be in his house? Hello again, Jot. If you're looking for weed killer bombs, you'll find them on the ground floor. I was a bit of a mess at the mole. Stairs are blocked. I can't bother clean up right now. I'm in the zone. I'll have to find another way to the ground floor. Yeah, I'm, not, I'm just here for possible art. Hip's not doing much. Okay, that's it.
That page is pretty basic. I found one in there. Yeah, I guess that's it. Maybe I missed it, or maybe I just haven't come across it yet. I don't know. Suppose you have a little die down now. Sorry, Gazi, my dude. It's for the good of the mountain. Come on, Jot. The way to the village is clear. There's it, it, Martina probably has it. Whoa, whoa, walk, buddy, jam session. Don't get to see those very often, Jot. For cheering us on through the power of metal. Thanks, fluffy dudes. I don't think I have enough cash for one, though. Oh, I got enough. Okay. Please be the one I'm missing. Crap, it's not. The image of the shooting minigame was a Saturday morning sci-fi cartoon. We call this gameplay section Riso Risotub. Why is it called Risotub? Okay, back to collecting cash. Can't talk to anyone? No. Nope. The village is destroyed. Soldier Snipe, I read the naughty associate behavioral report form. It seems you're responsible for dropping that saw blade. An act of sabotage, you're a dirty traitor. I can see it in your eyes. No, it wasn't even me, there was a rock slide. Shot at Traitor Snipe. Traitors and fools all around me. Oh, how I knew it. Well, Snipe, I must inform you that as per the employee in Crompton's Clause 389, we must regrettably let you go. Soldier, let Snipe go. Okay, that's two people dead in this game. Aha, let go. Am I not extremely skilled puns in wordplay? Need old magnificent hum grump, one of the best. The best. The best apologies, old master one. Now get back to work. All right, clear enough, associates. Back to work. Wait. Troublesome persons, troublesome persons. Obliterate them. God, I'm pretty chill dude, but these creeps strut around my village as if they own the place. It's really getting my goat. I can feel the targ spirit rising in me. Time to kick these marauders off the mountain. Time I stood up and joined you in combat. For Trog. Are you gonna actually- Oh, he's actually helping! Okay. Is he just tanking it all? Blammo! Okay, he actually helped for once. Ooh, that big dude packed a heavy bunch. Tom, all pretty good though, huh? Let's get going. Anything else here? <gasps> Our heroes came to a sudden halt. Ahead of them was Trog Village, wrecked by the mining blast, and crisscrossed by giant tracks. To that machine. The giant tracks of a giant machine. I check of the houses? Nope. Check behind the houses for anything? Can we check on the ins? No, we can't. Okay. Heavy metal. That's a bad mother of machine. I think it's gonna take both of us to defeat this thing, dude. Just kill soldiers. Okay. 
Okay, Thrash, you gotta do a little more than that. Look, Jot, those thing locks are exposed. If we can break them off, I'm sure we can stop this thing. Oh, crap. We got blades. Oh, that made it mad. We got company. I don't think Thrash is doing much work here. No use, that saw blade is too fast. Okay, you probably have to stop it. Have to work together, dude. You stop the saw blade with your stoppy powers. I'll yank off those locks. There. I'll get back in. Before Thrash gets surrounded. Now the bombs are in the real world. Is that a th oh no, they're in the cartoon. Okay, there. Lost a lot of health doing that. There. <clears throat> What's next? Hop out. Stamp. I don't think it's enough. There. Big button. Press the big button. Jot, the regulator is exposed. Give it a bash, dude. Sorry, Thrash doesn't want to do this. All done. Oh, it's out of control. The giant machine fell. Y yay! And exploded on the ground below into approximately 280 million pieces. I don't know about that. The bigger they are, the harder they plummet off the side of the mountain. Well known Midtown Troll saying, that is. You rock, dude, a perfect combo. Hey, the village folks must be around here somewhere. Let's roll on. Release the trolls! Crash, son, how long has it been? Too long, far too many days. Look at you, you're so much taller, even more handsome. Mom, come on, not in front of everyone. What, they can see all the see how see- they can all see how handsome you are. Mom! Crash, we watched how you handled that mechanical monster. Oh, uh, you caught that? You did great, very metal. You have the makings of a great trog warrior. We're proud of you, boy. Well, you know, it's like you taught me, Mom. You gotta take out the trash. Great Uncle Krog showed me some tricks. Great Uncle Krog, may you rest in glory. Good work, you two. You have hung grump all good old the wallop. You gave wallop. Home grump. That machine was extracting metal from the mountain, you know. 
I have word that humgrum schoons are transporting the ore somewhere. For what purpose? Beats me. That's something for you to figure out. Hop to it, lad. Zuh, shoo shoo. Boom beard out. Sounds like you have another mission ahead. Only just arrived, now off again. Come back to the mountain when you're done. You, your little cousins want to jam with you. I'll be back soon, Mom, I promise. The rest of the villagers are in prison around here. We'll go bust some troopers' heads and break them out. Frog speed to you both. Frog speed. The battle. The old man's going too. Hey dude, have I got have I got excavator aid? Have I got excavator brain or can you hear clanking? Where's he going? I don't know why that could be part George of the cinematic. Flash looked down from the cliffside. In the very far distance, they could spy. They're getting away. Speeding away. Our heroes set off to find out where Humgrump's cavalcade was heading. Chapter Seven. Beach Battle Boogie. Yeah, I missed one stamps art when I was there. Boogie Beach. Our heroes followed the cavalcade to the coast. To the funky land of Boogie Beach. Even the palm trees have shades. So here we are, Jot Boogie Beach, home of the Flamingos. From what I've heard, this place is serious rhythm. So Pump Grump hasn't totally killed the vibe. Okay. So a whole new area. Can I break this? No. I missed one of the art collectibles, but that's okay. I can grab it when I have to replay. Well, hopefully it tells me what chapter and gives me a hint as to where or something like that. But for now, I'll call this episode done and next session we'll just start on Boogie Beach and see how far I take it in the first 20, 30 minutes or so.